Welcome to the 2021 International Robotics Competition. This year's challenge with Zumi is called the Cruise to the Park Challenge. You can participate from anywhere in the world because the preliminaries will be a video submission and the finals will be a virtual video call. The Cruise to the Park Challenge will be divided into three challenges. The QR Code Parking Challenge, the Stop Sign and Driving Challenge, and the Traffic Light and QR Decision Challenge. Zumi will start at the start position on the map. This is a fully autonomous challenge, so once Zumi starts moving, she will need to get from start to finish without any controlling or contact. Make sure you've programmed a do-re-mi sound that lasts exactly three seconds. It should sound like this. You'll be using this sound four times throughout the challenges. Challenge A, QR code parking. For this challenge, Zumi will start at the start position facing west. She will be shown one of four QR codes for factory, school, office, or museum. Based on the QR code, she should drive to the correct location. You must play the Do Re Mi sound when you've detected the QR code. The clock starts as soon as Zumi plays the Do Re Mi sound. You will be awarded five points for every location you drive past and an additional 20 points if you park at the location that matches the QR code. Make sure Zumi is fully inside of the location box for it to count. There are a maximum of 40 points in this challenge. Then continue on to the next challenge. Challenge B, stop sign and drive. For this challenge, Zumi needs to align with the stop sign. You can use the funnel in the road to assist with that. A stop sign should be placed at the marker on the map before the start of your run. Zumi should stop before the stop sign, then wait. You must play the Do Re Mi sound when detecting the stop sign. Only when the stop sign is removed should Zumi continue on. The driving portion is divided into segment 1, segment 2, and segment 3. You will earn 5 points for driving through each segment. There are a maximum of 35 points in this challenge. Next, you'll continue on to the final challenge. Challenge C, Traffic Light and QR Decision. For this challenge, Zumi needs to align with the color sign. Like before, you can use the funnel in the road to assist. A red card should be placed at the marker on the map before the start of your run. Like before, Zumi should stop before the red color card and wait. As soon as the red color card is detected, you must play a Do Re Mi sound. Only when you swap in a green card should Zumi keep going. Then you will want to follow the line until you get up to the QR code located here. A QR code that says either left or right should be randomly selected and placed at the marker before your run. Make sure to play a Do Re Mi sound when the QR code has been detected. Zumi should turn at the T intersection in the direction of what the QR code says and continue on to the finish line. Remember, Zumi should be fully inside the finish marker of parking spot. The clock stops as soon as Zumi is fully stopped inside of the finished parking spot. There are two bonuses in this challenge. First, earn an extra 10 points if you program a small celebratory dance once Zumi finishes the entire run. You'll just need to include some movement and sound. Second, earn another extra 10 points if you display on Zumi's screen the QR code location from challenge one and which direction the QR code said in challenge three. There are a maximum of 55 points in this challenge and there are a total of 130 possible points for the entire challenge. Keep in mind, faster run times will be ranked higher. And there you have it. That's the Cruise to the Park Challenge this year. Head on over to robolink.com slash IRC2021 to register for the competition, get a competition package, and check out lessons and tips that will help you solve these challenges. Best of luck out there, contestants.